What's up YouTube? TF Bricks here. It's end of the month, so it's time for a city tour. And we got right off the bat, you got me rolling around. Got me some new people to add to the city who are going to help construct the city. We've got Burning Bricks, Happy Blues Place, Red Face Goose, End Talk, and Cos Bricks. They're rolling in, got some new people to help with the construction of the city. Because if you remember from my last city tour, I am currently working on redoing my city. And now for some reason my city has gone blurry. But I am redoing the city. New layout for preparation for Brickworld next year. Hopefully I can get in. And so we've got the fire brigade over here. It was back there and I moved it up here. And we got the game shop. We got Mario jumping. Pretty much this whole city is going to be able to be viewed from this side. Because that's how the organizer told me that they like to do, or want to start to do, their displays is viewed from one side. But this is my new layout. Let me know what you guys think down in the description below. There's really not any staging because I am still in the process of getting things set up for it. So sorry for there's no story really. This is more letting you know what's going on in the city so you can see, maybe give me some feedback and what you think. But all my, like my, like my pretzel shop, that's my custom mock. And then a bunch of these, everything up front here is stuff that is not from Lego, but from the custom market that have the instructions so I figured I'd have that up front and probably in the back is where the modulars are going to be from Lego so that they're not up front and center all more or less stuff you don't see is what I'm going to have displayed up front and so I'm working on this area here for a Japanese restaurant surf shop I thought maybe this could be some outdoor seating for the restaurant I kind of liked it pushed it back so you can get uh, not everything flush, so you have crevices and little areas where it's just not straight across. And then there's the pretzel shop with the brickwork finally somewhat completed. And that's all the tiles I got from AFOL Man. Well, not all the tiles, but at least what I need for right there. And you can see you've got all the sig figs pretty much over here, just lined up so I don't lose anybody while I'm working. And here's the park. I like having the park up front just because I like to have a lot of green. And you can see the whole area up front here is got trees. I think that's important to have in the city. And we got the welcome center over here. I like it. And we got a little chibi from Red Face Goose just hanging out. Like I said, still a work in progress. So you'll see a lot of stuff lying around because I am working on it and like I said little staging got the guy from the construction crew cleaning the road and here is the parking lot well not so much parking lot as is a car the car dealership the car lot everybody seemed to like it more on the side than in the front so that's what I'd gone with now there will be a curb and I figured I'd have a little pennants uh, running to the car dealership so let me know what you think I really like this area right here. I'm debating on whether or not I want to put my fountain right there. But I really like how we got the road come here. Then shoots over this way. And goes with a curve. And then also down here we've got a curve. So if I were ever to add a table right here. I'm going to put two buildings. Especially the corner ones. I can put two corner buildings right here. And have a whole row of buildings. If I ever decide to build out the other way. And then we got the pet shop. I'm not sure if I want to keep the pet shop there. Uh, but like I said, this is still a work in progress. And then there's the mystery build, which I need to start ordering some parts for that. I've been ordering for everything else but that. And as I was filming this video, Postman came, dropped off. So it's kind of a city tour slash haul video. I got from Shop at Home during the promotion. I got me the Spider-Man versus Rhino versus Sandman and 
I also ordered a whole bunch of tiles, but as we all know, shop at home takes a while for tiles to get here from the pick a brick. I did all that buying of brick that I need for the city and the Superman or the Spider Man set, not Superman, to get the free gingerbread house, which is awesome. Can't wait to build that guy. I really like it. And then here's the back of the city, which nobody will really see. They'll all see the front. This is what I'll see during the show. And then I've got uh, another one of those cafe corner, oh, not cafe corner, bike shop cafes. I'm going to turn this into a modular. I picked that up, but I like this back here. I think I'm going to have a park be behind the Japanese restaurant, kind of like a little city park, just something to go in there. And I, I got my front big park. I've moved the gazebo a little bit. Anyway, there's Farvel. Apparently he is not a fan of the Naked Cowboys plane. So he put down his newspaper and he's leaving. And I really like how I've got the bank up here and the movie theater. I'm not exactly sure how tall this is going to be. So it might be a little bit lower than the movie theater. I'm not 100% sure. And also, along with my Lego shop at home, I also got my BrickLink order from Bricks from Chris. So we got one by two dark bluish red or dark red tile. Got one by eight brown bricks. One by three light bluish gray. One by one in the azul blue. That is for the city market then we've got some one by six plate of the blue a bunch of two by two in the dark flesh uh a six by what is that 16 something like that so for some building then look at this a whole mess of one by two azul blue bricks and then one by two azul tiles and then some windows one by six brown bricks gray cabinets need those for something whole bunch of dark flesh one by two tiles more more tiles for all my modulars I'm working on two by two light bluish gray I don't know who that's for one by two azul blue uh, plates probably for the city market i think it's azul blue if not you guys know what i'm talking about it's not the blue it's not the dark blue it's the light blue baby blue maybe one by four some one by eights in white some red cabinets for something some fire uh cylinders in red some one by ones in brown some windows some more brown tiles, one by twos for something. And then just a couple pieces for something. I don't know. Now this area here, back to the city tour. This area here, I've got this destined for the city bank when that comes out. Because I have a, in my head, I have a vision of this bank fighting against that bank. Some way of money launchers or something some kind of fun little scene I want to do with bank versus bank I think that would be awesome then we got great emporium I'm thinking that I might put it here I might put it over there I I'm not sure but it's a corner building so it's gonna go here and then there is what I built for the live stream uh, was it two weekends ago when it was D from spirit particles which there she is right there it was build a Lego YouTuber's habitat, and I built Mr. Brick Adjuster's Sig Fig Bridge, which he did not guess it. Uh, Andrea and Bubble Bricks, they actually guessed it, and he, Brick Adjuster, did not catch on until they guessed what it was. I thought that was funny. And then, like course, I said, nothing but work being done i got railroad tracks over here i got some of my green plates for grass 
back here. I got the statue. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that. Basically, this is my catch-all back here while I'm trying to get everything squared away. So let me know what you guys think. It's kind of a city hall or a city tour hall video. Kind of everything mixed together and update for the city. So remember to leave your comments down in the description below. Hit that like button. Subscribe. Follow me on Flickr and Instagram at TFBricks. I'll be sure to leave a link to everybody who is new to the city. Probably even link to Bricks from Chris. Bricks for Chris is his YouTube channel. Bricks from Chris is his Bricklink store. So I'll probably even throw a link down into the description for his Bricklink store. Great guy. Sends me stuff. I get stuff from him all the time. Good guy to talk to. Everybody knows who he is. But that's all it. I'm rambling here at the end. Remember, to all our bricks.